Hey guys, welcome on back to another video, and today we will be reviewing um, set 75179 Kylo Ren Fighter, and this has 630 pieces. This is the ages 8 through 14, and this is a Lego Star Wars The Last Jedi set. And then it has four minifigures. You might say, no, oh, it has five minifigures. Well, if you don't know this one, this one is Han Solo Hoth, and I won't just be reviewing this. Be a double review. Dun dun. But um, I will also be reviewing Han Solo Hoth, so we'll do him first. Um, this is Han Solo Hoth. Um, he looks like a pretty good minifigure. Um, that's surprise kind of face, scared kind of face is pretty good. Um, hair is fine. I like the new one better, although I don't have the new one. And cool part about this one is you can mix and match like you can do this you can do this which is probably my favorite or you can do this like I said before I got two of them one for me one for my brother but my brother's has a Kylo Ren helmet on currently so yeah but anyways um, so turn to the side over there on the instruction book and let's get to the minifigures so First minifigure in this set is Kylo Ren. Um, it's a pretty good looking Kylo Ren. Um, here, how about we do this? So, view the minifigures on the instruction booklet. But, <clears throat> anyways, here he is, right here. Um, I think this might be our first time getting a lightsaber held by a black piece instead of a silver ish. And his lightsaber blade is blades are pretty cool. Um, I always wondered how they would get attached on, but here's this bottom piece, and then just stick it right on, and, um, he does have some more detail, he's more of an updated Kylo Ren, um, your piece is still the same, I think he has a longer scar than the other one, and then here's him, his angry face, don't do it, this is my fourth Kylo Ren, so, yeah. So, now the next minifigure is, um, it's the First Order TIE Pilot. Well, I'm not doing any order. I'm just doing some. But anyways, this is my first First Order TIE Pilot, surprisingly. Um, one day I have one for The Force Awakens, I'm pretty sure. But this is my first one. Um, this new helmet piece is really cool. Well, it's not really new, but... You know, but has that breathing thing on it, which is really cool. Um, the detail is really cool. Um, reminds me a lot like a uh, Jin Erso's um stormtrooper body, which I also have. But the face is fine. I wish I could change it up a little bit. It's just a stormtrooper's face. But yeah. So, um, next minifigure in the set is just. The Regular for first order stormtrooper. I have not a lot of these, surprisingly. I think you would probably expect uh, for me to have like 300 of these, but I only have like three. Um. <clears throat> Anyways, he's a pretty good stormtrooper. My favorite type of stormtroopers, um, besides the jetpacks ones. But he has some pretty nice printing. His helmet's really cool. But again, which I would wish they could have changed the face. But yeah, so next minifigure is BB-9E, and this one's pretty cool. He's like an evil BB-8. Yeah, so, except with that new um, helmet thing, face thing, I don't know. But overall, pretty good looking minifigure. So, uh, now we're going to take a look at the set. So, move these minifigures to a side. Let's take a look at the actual build. So, the actual build has some, some wings. And if you notice the difference, they all have these type of pieces right there. But, we lost one, so we just replaced it with that piece. But, the wings are pretty cool. Um, different for a TIE Fighter's wings, usually. Um, which was pretty surprising. Um, the other wings are the same thing. Um, there's lasers right over here, which 
shoot out. Um, oh, there we go. So you shoot out like that. Ow. So, but just went straight to the and put them. back in just like that um, and the laser thing you can open up the cockpit also um you can put your thumb right here and on the bottom fly away but overall um this is a pretty good set now the box design is Cool. I like the um, Ray, Poe Dameron, and Finn thing. Probably my favorite Star Wars box thing. And then you have the set on this thing, which is new. And here's the back of the box. Um, shows you some stuff it does. Oh, um, yeah. So the last thing is the instruction booklet. Um, Star Wars instruction book. That's one of my favorite. Um, because at the end, every new set line they have here, you have the Star Destroyer and uh, the two big sets crossing over each other like that. Um, and we got all the sets basically over here. We got all the minifigures over here, which is my favorite part to look at. Um, then we have all the Lego sets from the new Last Jedi Wave. So that's it for this double review, I guess. Um, let me know if you guys enjoyed this video. And, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.